to Niger. Of course. Um, France announced they would withdraw their military forces by the end of the year. Does this have any impact on the U.S.'s uh, posture there, any uh, moves forthcoming from us? It does not change um, uh, our posture. I will say that the Secretary did meet on Friday with members of, uh, with ECOWAS member states um, to discuss the political crisis in Niger. Um, we continue to call for uh, the National Council for the Safeguarding uh, of the Homeland to release President Bazoum and his family. Uh, and all the other members of his government who have been unlawfully detained um, uh, and to take steps to restore democracy in the country. Has there been any engagement with the junta since uh, Tory Newland's trip there? Uh, we have uh, ability to get messages to uh, the junta when it is in our interest to do so, but I don't have any specific conversations to read out. When was the last time a message was conveyed to them? Uh, I, don't, I, I don't have that. that and lastly, do you have any updates on Bazoom's well-being? Uh, we, we continue to be concerned about his well-being, the fact that he continues to be under detention and has not been released. Um, it's been uh, a matter that has concerned us for some time. We do have uh, uh, engagements with President Bazoom and have regular conversations with him. And it is that concern for his well-being, uh, that concern for his well-being is one of the reasons why we call uh, uh, for uh, for his immediate release.